Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is another rant by me, Hello Mayo. Uh, today's rant is why I do not focus my energy on Islam. I am responding to a quote unquote Christian troll who recently trolled my video. This troll claimed that he was not a Christian, but he believes in the God, Yahweh, Jehovah, and Jesus Christ. He couldn't defend his faith without using fallacious arguments. This is what all Christians do. Alright, here's the first fact. Christianity gave birth to Islam. This is a fact. The Quran is a straight pleasurization of the Bible, and the Bible is pleasurization of other mythologies that predate it. Allah ben Yahweh is the full name of the Abrahamic God. Got some information from Aaron Ra, and after studying the Bible and the Quran, looking at them side by side, looking at the names, how they name Allah and the God of the Bible, they have the same similar names, saying Lord and this and that and Almighty and whatever. It's the same God. That could be drawn to that conclusion. Moving on to the main point of this video. Why I don't need to address Islam. Islam kills itself. For every head and every person they stone and they behead and lop their head off. That is rope for Islam to lynch itself. I don't need to speak against Islam. And, and once again, how they suppress women and they treat them like animals and general mutilation and and they kill women who try to stand up against Islam and all this stuff there's some more rope for Islam to lynch itself I don't need I don't need to speak any whatever against Islam Islam already lynched itself Islam has the same characters as the Christian Bible Adam and Eve Noah Abraham Jesus Christ that's the same characters. What's, what's the point? Muslims use the same fallacious arguments as Christians to defend their faith. For instance, circular reasoning, special pleading. They fail to prove that the doom of burning, a.k.a. hell, was not stolen from Egyptian mythology. Speaking of Egyptian mythology, they want to destroy the pyramids. With the new Muslim Brotherhood in Egypt, they want to destroy the pyramids. Why? Because I was right. That thing did come from Jewish mythology. And another thing, all they did was downgraded Jesus Christ as a prophet of Allah, Allah bin Yahweh. <laughs> oh, that's all they did. Really. And all they did was replace Jesus Christ for Muhammad. They gave Muhammad the main attention in the Quran. That's all they've done. They replaced Jesus with the main attention in the Bible. And in the Quran, they, they replaced Jesus for Muhammad. And that's all they did. There's really nothing really new here. And the Muslims believe in a resurrection day. They believe in a day of judgment as well. It's in their Quran. I, I, it's in there. You know, I'm not making this up. It's in there. I just haven't had time to look through it real thoroughly. But it's in there. I, I came across it a few times. Why I attack Christianity above Islam? Because Christianity is more popular than Islam. Obviously, Han, I live in America, where Christianity is the predominant religion, and they pass laws in the name of Jesus. That's why I attack Christianity. Christianity can become more violent than Islam, because you heard stories about uh, Clefo Dollar abusing his daughter, and then the guy tells him he wants to fry all the uh, gays into a little uh, concentration camps. They can become even more violent than Islam. If yeah, for real, literally, they can and they can start burning people up again. They can start beheading people again in the name of Jesus, because this happened in the Dark Ages. This is why I attack Christianity above Islam. Islam is in the Dark Ages, like uh, Christianity was. You know, as I just mentioned. Christianity has done more damage to the world. It has brought slavery, racism, 
promotes killing non-believers, promotes sexism, and it gave birth to Islam. It has no evidence to back up none of its claims. And the list goes on and on and on and on. That's why I attack Christianity above Islam. I don't need to attack Islam. Islam already lynched itself. So, if you're, you're saying I'm full of crap or whatever, or I'm, I'm double standard, no. I'm not double standard. Because, like I said before, over, and I'm going to say it again, Islam lynched itself. For every head they chop off, they give rope to themselves. For every woman they stone, they give rope to themselves. For every child they suppress and all this stuff, you give rope to yourself. I have no need to attack Islam. You know what? If I really had the power and I really had my own nation, that would be the first thing to go. These religions. Because they are harmful to the planet. It's man controlling man.